Hi, I'm Dave Burton of Advanced Tech Support. The purpose of this short video is to show you how to add or alter device symbols in the PCNet 005 application. First, we must log on to the system, go to the program option, and then to programming. In this menu, you will find symbol management. Selecting this option will bring up the configuration screen for device symbols. As you can see, there are a number of pre-existing symbols in there for simple indications such as fire or pre-alarm and more complex indication for devices. To add a symbol, you simply click on the Add button, which will take us to the Symbol Creation window. A simple symbol is an on-off icon, such as pre-alarm or isolation. A compound symbol is typically linked to a detector which has multiple sub-elements to it, such as fire, fault and disablement, and so on. Provide a description and hit OK, and it will add our new device to the bottom of the list. To configure the pictures, simply select the Pictures option, which brings us to the individual sub-elements of the device. Setting the node type to an advanced fire panel allows you to see information for fire alarm, pre-alarm, etc. You can then import a picture file using the Import button, or use a pre-existing one from the library contained within PCNet 005 and populate this list of devices. To alter a pre-existing image, rather than creating a new one, you can simply select the device. So I will select the Apollo Discovery device. Again, go to Pictures, and that brings us to the pre-programmed images of all of the different types, such as fire, etc. Again, changing the node type to an advanced fire panel tells you what the actual symbol corresponds to. If we want to change a symbol, you can simply select, for example, a pre-alarm and either import a new picture file directly over the top of that, or if this particular event is not required, you can clear this information down. Thank you.